Go ahead and tell them I'm celebrating Dolly's birthday. He's celebrating Dolly's birthday with the bottle. So Rob Schneider apparently has a daughter named Ellie King. She is a country singer songwriter aged 34. So Ellie was playing at the Grand Ole Opry admitting to having one or two too many drinks and she drunkenly started singing a Dolly Parton song for her 78th birthday. <laughs> So Ellie starts completely messing up her lyrics to marry me and starts cursing and swearing, clearly very intoxicated. She even admits herself to messing up the lyrics. I don't know. Then after that bizarre drunk cover, she starts to kind of clown on the audience for buying tickets in the first place. I was like, holy shit, we bought tickets for this shit. I'm not even gonna lie. Damn. I'm not even gonna lie. That's a B side for you. <laughs> holy shit. I'm not even gonna lie. You all bought tickets for this shit? So just when she couldn't add enough fuel to the fire, she starts saying like, you're not getting your money back and has this little back and forth with this guy in the audience. You ain't getting your money back. I'll tell you one thing. I'll tell you one thing. I don't true. want it. I don't want it. Good. Cause you ain't getting it. That's that's it. That's I'll, I'll tell you one thing more. I'll tell you one thing more. Hi, my name is LK. I'm so the Grand Ole Opry posted this saying, due to unforeseen circumstances, Lauren blah, 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 won't be appearing on tonight's Oprah Goes Dolly. And this person ends up replying saying, I wish she would have been there because Ellie King ruined the night with her horrible drunk and profane performance. Dolly Parton would have been mortified for our first time at the Opry. It was a shame we all had to witness that. <laughs> to which the Grand Ole Opry ended up saying, hi Judas, we deeply regret and apologize for the language that was used during last night's second Opry performance. Dolly Parton has yet Yet to respond on this matter but it is safe to say people were not feeling ellie king which if i'm gonna be honest i have to kind of agree with people's points here i mean would it have been funny if she would have just ended it after the i don't remember the lyrics part and just said like sorry i'm drunk now let's go back to the music i think that would have been okay i just felt she carried it on a little bit too long got a little obnoxious by the end like why'd you guys even buy tickets to this blah blah, blah. yeah maybe you need to quit the liquor i don't know it was just a little too extra for me but I don't know. Maybe I'm crazy. But anyway, guys, that is the news. Thank you for watching. And you guys know the drill. Ta-ta for now. <laughs>